All right, family. So I've been having this word and this advice I've been wanting to give you guys for a few days now. And even reading this devotional today kind of just even sparked that too. But the I watched the service, you know, with Pastor Stephen Furtick, and he was saying, do the next best thing. Okay, and so that's what we're going to be talking about. And these are, I'm going to give you two stories that are going to be helpful for you when it comes to your nutrition and your fitness. Do the next best thing. We are, I feel like we are, are like this. We're all in, like all in or nothing. Like if we cannot 100% do something, then we're kind of like, eh, I'm not even, then I'm not even going to do that right now. Like I don't have the time to do this right now. Like I wish I could go to the gym five days out of the week. But I just don't have the time right now. So you know what? I'll tackle that in six months. But we got to remember, we got to do the next best thing. And, and while we're on the example of the gym, if you wish you want to go to the gym five days a week because everybody goes five days a week, then what is the next best thing? Because I tell you this because this is how I live my life. I always do. What is the next best thing? And, and I'm not good in every part of my life like this, but I try to remind myself, okay, if I cannot do five days, what can you do? Can you do three? Perfect. Then let's do three. But I'm going to give you the example of the nutrition. Let me give you the example on nutrition. You know, you start eating healthy. You know, you start eating your chicken, your rice, your veggies, your fruits, and then you might start eating and then you, you, you start losing weight, but then you notice that you start feeling hungry. You know, somebody might be like, oh, my God, I'm, I'm feeling hungry. I don't want to eat more because if I eat more, I'm going to go back to my old weight. And a lot of people quit because they end up eating more food and then end up quitting eating the healthy stuff. And they go back to their old habits of eating junk food. But in that moment, you got to remember what would be the best next thing when it comes to eating healthy. Okay, so if you're already eating healthy food, but you're just feeling a little bit hungry throughout the day, the next best, best thing you could do is, okay, let's increase food, healthy food, into my meals. So maybe for dinner, let's add one cup of rice extra. Let's just do it. So that's the next best thing because you're feeling hungry. Let's just add one cup of rice, you know, and... It, it probably might not be ideal for you because you're like, oh my God, I don't want to increase food because I'm not going to lose the amount of weight that I was losing. But if you think about it, adding that rice, one extra cup might slow down a little bit of your weight loss. But instead of losing two pounds every week, you might be losing one, but at least you're still moving towards your goal. But a lot of people, we don't do the next best thing because we either we do it all 100% or we don't want to do it. And so... That's what I want you guys to remember. Let's always think about what would be the next best thing. You know, it sucks that we cannot do it as perfectly as we want, but what would be the next best thing to move us forward? All right, fam. Hope you have a good day. Peace.